to this is Daisy thank you guys for watching um, today I'm going to bring to you this beautiful rendition that I like to call the glamorous Medusa <laughs> and um, yeah this was super fun to put together this is super affordable affordable for my babes on a budget out there um, something completely different. I am such a fan of Medusa. We grew up seeing so many reruns. My family was such a diehard avid fan of the movie. Uh, my mom doesn't know English and <laughs> all you hear her <laughs> is talking about the movie. Like, Daisy, did you see those snakes? It's like so gross. You gotta see this. It's such a monster and whatnot. And um, it's kind of fun uh, hearing her talk about it. <laughs> So um, yeah, if you're a fan of Medusa or you're just a fan of this look and want something different but fun and easy to actually get together, then you came to the right place. And um, yeah, let's just dive into this fun stuff. So if you want to watch, you know what you got to do, right? You know. <laughs> Keep on watching. Okay, so let's get glamorous Medusa on her feet. So we're just going to start out blanking out our canvas and putting on some concealer here. And I'm going to go ahead and set that. So now we're going to start with our eyebrows because we're going to go ahead and add that beautiful green reflective kind of color going on. So I'm going to go into my Urban Decay palette, carefully just go over my eyebrows with the color Junkie and it's a beautiful emerald green with specks of gold. So I'm just going to pick up a Real Techniques brush, very small, and just pat over my eyebrows. Go ahead and clean up the bottom of it and you just uh, put some concealer on your brush. I'm going to go back into my Urban Decay Vice palette and I'm going to pick up that stunning green that we used already for our eyebrows. We're going to take a blending brush from my BH palette. I'm going to use this matte green right here to blend it out. And I tell you, this is not a color that I would normally gravitate to. I am not a fan of this type of green, like that bold apple kind of green. I never really liked that green, but this type of green, like this forest green, is just enchanting. <laughs> so we're just blending. And we're gonna take it out a little bit, almost like a wing. Pack on that initial green right on our eyelids because I feel like I lost some of the beautiful intensity. And it's just the same green called Junkie. This color is stunning. It's just beautiful, something about it. I'm just so drawn to it. Okay, so now we're gonna put some highlighter in our inner corners and I'm gonna use vanilla uh, MAC pigment. I just went ahead and rearranged my snakes because I think it actually looks cooler. <laughs> Alright, so now we're going to um, add some glitter. So what I'm going to do is uh, use some of my e.l.f. Lock and Seal and put it in the cover where the glitter came from the packaging. And what we're going to do is just uh, apply it on the inner corner. We're going to go back into the same green again and just start applying under my eye. I'm going to take a baby blue. You can take any sky blue or anything along those colors that you have. Right here. And I'm just going to smoke out the bottom eye. Right, so my battery died and I'm not sure where I left off, but what I just did was apply the same green at the bottom part of my eyes. The same green that we had in our eyelids, which is called Junkie from the Vice palette. And um, I just went ahead and rearranged the snakes a little bit more because they actually look cooler the more that they hang. So. <laughs> All right, so let's just continue along. So what I'm going to do now is add some gel eyeliner. I'm going to use the Maybelline 24 hour infallible gel liner. And we're just going to make a simple wing. So now we're just going to go ahead and apply eyeliner to our waterline. Now I'm going to apply falsies and mascara. Now I'm going to use um, this blush subtle by Lancome and it's in the name Cedar Rose and I'm going to do some slight contouring with this. So just blend this out. Okay, I'm going to add some blush and I'm going to go into my BH Plus uh, palette. I'm going to use this dusty rose color right here. 
I'm going to apply some highlighter and this is from uh, MAC Vanilla Pigment. By the way, any products that are in this video that's been mentioned, I will go ahead and write it on the bottom of um, your screen. And these eyelashes, I will also write where they're from because they're so funky and different and they're va 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 boom and they just pull this whole look together. So now the piece de resistance, de resistance, <laughs> I am going to use green because it goes hand in hand, synonymous with the snake. So of course we're going to use green. I don't have green lipstick, so this is a green eyeliner and it's called Dark Emerald by Giordano. And I'm just going to fill in my whole lip with it. This is dark emerald green, but for some reason it looks a little bit kind of like on the blue family. But I assure you it's a dark green. I'm going to put on a little bit of that green eyeshadow that we were working with at the beginning. And just pat it on lightly on top just to give it a more va-va-va-voom. Snakes, stay in place. And I'm just patting it lightly. Sometimes I just get amazed on the pigment of these things. And we're trying to give it some of that reflective quality that snakes are known for. There you have it. This is the whole look. It is so different. It is so cool. I just love it. Um, all I did is just pin these snakes on my head and um, I also colored it. You can use your eyeshadow, spray paint, whatever you want. I went and just uh, went ahead and I'll pin my hair back and uh, just keep it nice and simple because you have enough going on over here and you know it's just a cool effect I mean I'm like glowing over here <laughs> like a little kid and um, I just pair this up with a nice choker what I would wear with this is a long simple black dress and not super tight but fitted regular fit with some beautiful jeweled sandals and some nice cuffs or something like that and girl you be working it in the city <laughs> i hope you guys enjoyed i will try and pump out one more because halloween only comes once a year and i get to play around you know and why wouldn't i right so if you guys enjoy this look i think it looks so freaking awesome but still hip and sexy and glamorous and um if you guys wear it let me know yeah i hope this was fun for you i think this is just so hot please guys subscribe i look forward to your comments and until the next time don't forget always have fun till the next time Mwah. Meow.